And in today's video, I'm out here at Clayton Homes in Franklinton, North Carolina. I'm out here touring the Freebird. Now the Freebird is a three bedroom, two bath home, beautiful home. It's already been sold, so the lights aren't set up, but we're gonna do the best we can so I can bring you this tour. Get ready, it's a good one. All right, again, this is the Freebird, you guys. Beautiful three bedroom, two bath home. I'm hoping I'm able to find these homes online so I can get you a good exterior picture. This is the Freebird. I keep hearing like a screwdriver, so I hope I'm not in this home and they're taking it apart. Um, I think they're in the home behind me, but we'll check it out. <laughs> I turned the lights on and they didn't come on, but that's because they're preparing this one. But it's so beautiful, I had to show it to you. So. Let's go inside and do a quick tour. This is what you see when you enter the home. You've got your living room here. So there's your living room. Really nice. They do have a section away here, but I'm gonna tell you, it's so much space that you could probably put a different type of furniture in here. Big furniture, oversized furniture if you like, and still have a lot of space. They put the TV on this wall, huge um, console table, really beautiful, really nice use of space. Again, this is the living room. Love it. The living room overlooks the, the dining room and the kitchen and they're separated by a wall. So we're gonna take a look at the dining room first. Love it. You got two windows in here. Lots of space for entertaining. You could choose, this table actually has a leaf in it, so this is a table that you can make smaller or larger if you choose. That's something that I think works in maybe a small family, but they have a lot of family that visit. So, you know, I always look at these tables and I say, wow, that's such a good idea. And if we ever decide to get a different table, I definitely would do that for when we have um, company over. But this, you guys, is the dining room. Again, the lights aren't on in this one, so if it's kind of dark, I apologize. I do have a light on my tripod. I don't think it's doing that much good. But this is a dining room, okay? And then next to the dining room, you have the kitchen. Nice island, you can put four tables here. What a cute bar stool, I love it. That way, this isn't cutting into your thighs. Love it. You can put four of those bar stools at this table. I always love when they do a different color on the island. Um, I just love it. And I love this. It's kind of an olive green. You don't see that a lot. Really pretty. They got dark countertops in here. The color cabinets kind of put me in the mind of the Rio. We've toured that home already. But yeah, really nice kitchen. Love all the cabinets in here. Lots of storage space, pantry space in this kitchen. Really lovely. Really lovely. So that's the kitchen. Really nice. And then next to the kitchen again is the dining room so you can actually enter the dining room um, from this side and from the side that I walked in and out of so really nice so you have a separate space you have an open space but it is kind of separate love it love it love it love it all right this is the kitchen you've got your back door there and then you've got sort of a mud room area here Really nice. Now this isn't built in, this is something they added, but what a great idea for what you can do in this space to maximize your storage. Like you could put shoes under there, hang book bags and coats and scarves and umbrellas in this area. What a lovely idea. Or you could put shelving in this area and have additional storage for like appliances and stuff like that. So really up to you. Your washer and dryer goes on this side. And that is your laundry room. This is your AC unit probably, yep. AC unit here. 
They've got the electrical panel hidden. It's got, it's, uh, I guess it's locked. It won't open for me. Oh yeah, I see the thing. They got it locked. That's the electrical panel. I love the fact that it's not that gray, ugly looking metal. Really nice. So yeah, that's your kitchen. And again, you got your kitchen, dining room, and living room here. Now, if you notice when you walk in, there's no hallway or bedroom on this side. You've just got living space here. And then down this hallway, you've got your additional bedrooms and your primary. So the first room that you get to is additional bedroom number one, nice size bedroom. You got a standard closet. Really lovely. So that's additional bedroom number one. Now this home has vents in the sit floor, but if you want them in the ceiling, you know what you gotta do. You just order your home with vents in the ceiling. Really lovely. So that's a nice size bedroom. That's your additional bedroom number one. Next to your additional bedroom, my light is doing a little something. You have your additional bathroom. Really lovely. Adequate space in here. It's cozy, but it's adequate space in here. You've got um, beautiful sink in here that matches the aesthetic of the house. The cabinets in the kitchen, really lovely. And so does the uh, material. I don't know if that's wood or not around the mirror. So really pretty. That's your additional bedroom. Sorry, it's kind of dark. But again, the lights have already been turned off in here. And then you've got your second additional bedroom here. Another nice space. Another nice space. Love it when the bedrooms are a nice size. And another standard closet. So really lovely. Very nice. Really nice. And then at the end of the hallway, you have your primary bedroom. Love it. Love the amount of space in this bedroom. Really pretty. You got even space for a seating area or if you wanted to put a, a TV like Cata Corner over here, you absolutely could. I'm going to walk over here so you can get an idea of how big this space is. Really lovely. This is your primary closet. Not a large space. But this is perfect for somebody. Really nice. So this is the primary closet. And again, this is the primary bedroom. Big, beautiful room. You've got your primary bathroom here. Double sinks here. Those same mirrors in this room. You've got your walk-in closet here with two, depending on what's, what, what you're working with, either two footstools or two seats. And then your toilet area is behind this wall here. Really lovely. And then you've got a little space over here to do it with your light, whether you put hampers over here or shelving or do what they did. So really nice. Beautiful. Those are so cute. So that's the primary. Got a window in here that opens. Always a plus. I bet y'all say I call out the same things, but those are the things that I like in a home. Though, and some of them are the things that I wish I had insisted on when I was purchasing mine. So... All right, so again, this is the free bird. It's a three bedroom, two bath, 1,385 square feet. The total price of this home is 137.18. This home has been sold. So if you're interested in this home, go to your nearest Clayton Homes and tell them that you saw the free bird and you are interested in 
um, talking about the features of the home, okay? All right, I hope you enjoyed this tour. We'll see you in the next one.